we exist to provide um, support services, advocacy services and prevention services to Lanarkshire and our main cohort of beneficiaries are women and girls who have been subjected to any form of sexual violence at any point in their lives. I think that would be a, a, certainly a devastating impact for anyone who needs the service. Um, and we're already aware that we're we are sort of under-resourced, we're not able to meet the demand that is already there. Um, you know, we, we always aim to have a short waiting list. What we've found over the last six months or so, that the waiting list has actually increased just because of the demand. Um, so I think if, if we were to close, it would leave an enormous gap in a specialist service um, for people who really want that safe space to, to, to recover from that form of sexual violence. I think for our service, um, a, a multi-year guarantee is, is really beneficial because the third sector has always been affected by this inability to plan and inability to really do the development work um, and, and meet the needs in a sustainable way because we've, you know, the, the uncertainty about that funding um, and it really is very difficult to, to put that development work in when you're not sure whether you're going to be de delivering something year on year. So having that guarantee means that you can really focus on the work um, and I think it would be very freeing for, for charities, small charities, to, to not have to have so much of their time in applying for funding, you know, submitting in multiple reports. Um, it, it can be quite kind of onerous, but I think what we want to do is make sure that any funder has good quality information and it's not just data for data's sake. I think having that, that variety, you know, for some people it's an, it's an in-person events, you know, for others that's sharing of, of you know, reports and, and research. I think being able to have multiple different ways that people can engage and, and join up in partnership is, is what it's all about, because some people are more digitally confident than others, um, but we still recognise the value in having face-to-face -face meetings where we can really chat and, and get support from one another. A, a charity such as ours, you know, we, we want to campaign about the issues that we feel strongly about, um, but we know that we share a lot of you know, concerns and um, needs that, that other small charities in the area do. So I think, you know, coming together, we've got a, a stronger voice collectively um, to, to be part of this campaign. So yeah, I'm really grateful to have our, our input in that.